food, a common ground, our universal experience. No matter who you are or what you do, we all eat food. You don't chop. <laughs> Is food available? Is food affordable? Is there food wastage? If food is not available, why are we wasting food? Take a second. Think about your dustbin. Do you have some leftovers here? What is the yearning of every Nigerian today? One, we want good food. We want fresh food. We want food that are pesticide free. Food not yet injected with herbicides. Much more than that. We want food to be consistent. I don't want to eat maize only during rainy season. I want maize even during dry season. You want to know that you can buy tomatoes any time of the year, but for the same price. You want to know that you can get yam any time of the year for the same price, such that every day is New Yam Festival. Is that possible? <laughs> the answer is yes. Aeroponics. What does, what does that mean? Aeroponics is the ability to grow crops in the air without the use of soil. We are able to grow the plant without the soil element. Now you can plant anywhere. Oh, you do not have enough land. Don't worry, we don't need the land. You just need space. Oh, how about waiting for rainy season before I plant? No, we are not dependent on season. You can plant any time of the year. The picture on your screen, you have yam growing in the air. Next to that, you have tomatoes growing in the air. This is in um, Il Araromiake, about 45 minutes from Il Okperu. That is about 30 minutes from Shagamu in Ogun State. That is tomatoes growing in the air. Here you have a setup. To the top left, you have a system before we planted. To the top right, there you have the bus to show that there is nothing inside. There is no soil or nothing inside. Bottom left, you have, yeah, bottom right, you have the root of the plant. And you realize that we do not have soil in that place. And to the left, we have GP tanks buried in the ground. That is the source of our nutrients to feed the plants. You can also have this system even in your houses, in your offices, meaning you can do agriculture anywhere. You don't need to have a land before you can farm. You can grow your own vegetables in the comfort of your offices. Replace your flowers with your vegetables. Someone would ask, what are the benefits of hydroponics? One, labor. Today, if you want to start a farm, there is a fear of hoe. How am I going to manage the farm? Won't the laborers steal my crops? With aeroponics, with just a clicker, you can manage your farm. 10,000 plots of land, you just need one clicker. A small box of farm, just same clicker. So your labor is way cheaper because the future of agriculture is not mechanized farming but automated farming. Environment. Because of aeroponics technology, you do not have to use herbicide because what you did not plant in the air cannot grow. So no need to spray herbicide to kill the grass, which means the environment is safer for you and me. You don't have to use insecticides because now you have a cleaner environment for, the, for us and for the future generation. Aeroponics ensure that you get your food fresh. So if you want to get tomatoes, you don't have to wonder, oh, was this tomatoes imported three months or five months ago? Has it spent 10 years in the freezer? No. You can plant it right in your house and you have fresh food any time of the year. Aeroponics ensure you get income generation. How do I mean? If you have a plot of land and you want to plant tomatoes, you can only plant tomatoes on one layer. But remember, we plant in the air. How far is the sky? really far. How high can you plant? You have so many layers. So your one plot of land can be equivalent to six plots of land if you decide to do six layers of planting. It can become 12 plots of land if you decide to do 12 layers of planting. Beyond that, aeroponics ensure that you get your harvest faster than usual. Tomatoes takes three months in the soil. In aeroponics, it takes just one month. Yam takes nine months to 12 months, depending on the size you want. In aeroponics, it takes three to four months. Lettuce takes about three months. In aeroponics, you would harvest in one month. 
Bali takes about three to four months. In aeroponics, we harvest in, who wants to guess? Seven days. What does that mean? Now we can stop the, uh, the headsmen farmers' fight because you need grass to feed them. Now you can grow their grass in seven days and the conflicts are out. This is a little story, how we all started in Ibadan. When we started, this is the system before we planted yam. This is three months later, you can see the real bush of yam growing. And here you have inside the bosses, we had to put the biro and the marker for people to see the length of the yam. That is about one meter length yam to show that, yes, it is possible. Now, food cannot, might no longer be a problem because with aeroponics, you can smile. Thank you.